wanted to do an unboxing video real quick. A long time ago, I ordered a Starship to get uh, 3D printed from my days in Star Trek Online. I was really excited when they uh, offered like the in-game plugin to take one of your Starships that you have and just like 3D print it for you. So I just went like nuts on it and I got like the biggest one. And um, what it turns out is the the actual uh, model I chose because uh, I you know I ran like science vessels and I uh, did nebula class. So what it turns out is that the, the paint scheme and the size of the ship kind of proved a little difficult for them. They ended up saying it was the biggest one that they've ever done. So I'm just gonna just unbox this here. I'm really excited. I've waited a long time for it. They uh, they actually had some issues printing it, but uh, game print is was like really communicative and really great with uh, giving me updates. Uh, even like offered me chances to get refunds at one point, um, uh, but I, um, I I I pushed it through. I really wanted the starship and really wanted it uh, to look like and see what it looked like. Um, so this is gonna be the USS Caligari. That's the ship that I ran. And all right, here we go. Also, I'm a Hurricane Florence evacuee, so I couldn't actually ship it to my house because my house had like a 100 foot tall pine fall on it. So I'm at my um, at my dad's house, so um, I uh, uh, had them ship it here and they were really cool about it and changed the shipping address before it shipped. So here we go. You know, some of these companies just are not very communicative, but every time I emailed them, they answered me and uh, gave me updates, and that was really nice. Uh, I've experienced companies that do stuff like this that basically they go pretty dark and don't give you any updates. Okay, packing peanuts. Let's see here. All right. Nah, you know what? Screw it. We'll clean it up later. There's no dogs in here, so they're not going to eat packing peanuts. Uh, cool, cool, cool. All right, some, some nice, cool little... Um, pieces of uh, stuff. It seems pretty stable, so that's nice. Okay, so I'm just gonna, uh, no. Uh, all right, let's just, no, bye. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, hey, fragile. Let's see some tape, and, okay, this is taped pretty well. There's more stuff in there, but. <laughs> so here we go. Uh, I can see it through the plastic. Oh my god. Oh god, it's so heavy. Oh, this looks so sweet. So I always called my ships the uh, USS Caligari, so I went through, ended up going through like five of them, so there's the E right there. That's pretty cool. So this was actually 3D painted instead of hand painted, so I, I, I'm not exactly sure what, what the decision was there. I think it's because of the the way it is, or maybe they had some production issues with painters, not really sure, but honestly, it looks pretty good. Before I made that decision to go forward with it, I saw some pictures of some of the other stuff that they 3D painted, and it looked pretty good, and I gotta say, this actually looks pretty good, too. I actually went with some of this black trim on here because one of the scans that we did had some, like, weird rendering issues, but it made it look like this, and I thought it looked pretty wicked cool, uh, so I kind of just went with that, so... That's pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna open up whatever else is in here. So we're gonna put the ship right there for now. Yeah. All right, so we're just gonna open this up. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, that looks great. All right, so that is just supposed to sit right here. Right like that. that's it cool yeah so that's it actually I think it looks pretty good I think that uh, I'm really happy with that yeah I really like it and that's uh that's ended up what it looks like it's like real heavy like I don't know like this may be like I don't know maybe four or five pounds maybe it's it's pretty thick and it looks pretty sturdy even some of the joints here on the nacelles here like they look pretty sturdy the kind of the little science pod tactical pod on top looks pretty sturdy it, yeah, it looks and feels pretty good. I actually am pr really happy with this. So that's, that's my experience with game print. Now that I have the finished product, I feel really good about it. So there we go. Uh, if you got any questions, just uh, <laughs> shoot me a message in the comments. All right, bye.